Hi everyone, it's Dr. Samantha Smith. I am a home health physical therapist that specializes in knee replacements. I have seen over a thousand knee replacements at this point in my career, so I'm trying to educate as many people as I can to improve their outcomes. Um, I now have a website available with many detailed blog posts about knee replacements written by a me and other things available including ways to contact me and I also do phone consultations so please visit my website it is succeedcourses.com so now let's get into the topic of this video why does my knee feel so tight it either feels like a rubber band sensation around the knee or just general pressure or like a balloon is about to pop there's a lot of different ways to describe it and there are several reasons why this might happen but most likely it's a combination of all the reasons these symptoms are really really common early on in recovery but they can linger for up to six months so the first reason and the most common reason is the swelling so after surgery you will have swelling for up to six months and i know that sounds like a very long time however it will slowly become better with time you won't have the same amount of swelling for six months so because the swelling is so significant after surgery it causes a lot of pressure in the joint the knee joint is covered by a capsule of connective tissue. This capsule helps fluid stay in the joint to lubricate it. It helps our joints stay stable so we aren't just like wobbling around. When we walk, joint capsules are very important. However, because the joint capsule creates this casing around the joint, it becomes full of fluid and swelling after surgery. So this is a reason why you feel like you have a lot of pressure or you feel like the balloon is about to pop. In your knee this can also present like the rubber band feeling in the knee there's a lot of fluid building up in the capsule from surgery so one way to release this pressure is by elevating the knee using ice or biking biking is very effective to improve the swelling in the knee it our muscles act as like a pump to help pump fluid out of the body and this can help move the fluid temporarily so another reason tightness happens is because the knee is now slightly bigger than it was before so a normal non-arthritic knee has some space in between it so we have the meniscus the cartilage joint fluid good healthy bone after a joint has been worn down over those years we we lose all that stuff in between the bones the bones even start deteriorating and they get eaten away by constant inflammation and wear. Most people have had an arthritic knee joint for several years before they decided to do surgery. So as you can imagine, that knee has shrunk down to a smaller degree. And then when you get your new knee, it will become back to more of its like normal size or possibly a little bit bigger. So a knee replacement has the metal implants attached to the bone, but it also includes a plastic piece in between the two pieces of metal which acts as your shock absorption kind of like your meniscus and it also eliminates any of that metal on metal happening which would be really really noisy so because the knee joint has now been expanded that causes a lot of tightness in the joint the muscles are tighter the ligaments the tendons everything has been stretched out in just like one day so on the topic of tendons ligaments and muscles i always ask my patients if they had full range of motion before surgery most of the time the answer is no their knee was very stiff and painful to bend and again if you had poor range of motion before surgery you betcha you're gonna have a lot of symptoms of tightness after surgery and they will become amplified because of the pain the injury from the surgery and because of swelling so improving the tightness is something PTs can help you with. Based on my experience as a PT, biking and stretching the knee helps the most and then elevation and ice can supplement. So the relief and tightness will, co will come really quickly after biking and stretching, but it'll only last for a short amount of time. So this is normal and expected, especially if you're early on in your recovery, like between one and three months. And the best thing you can do long term is to focus on your PT exercises and your stretches and keep moving your knee. And once your range of motion improves and you can bend and straighten your knee to its 
full capacity, you'll notice less tightness. So I hope this helps kind of answer some questions about why you have the tightness. I know it can be so frustrating. And this is a really, really common question that I get um, from my patients. So I hope this video is helpful to some of you out there. Um, I always like to mention at the end of my videos to please join my Facebook group. I will link it in the description below. But it's, it's a Facebook group that I created, but I also participated and I will answer people's questions in the group. But I also do a monthly live in the Facebook group where people can ask me questions and I'll answer them on a live video. So please join. And again, as always, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you again next time.